Okay, I'm making a new video. Um, I didn't make one in a long time, but I'm making one again now. Um, this is going to be a moving mouse pointer tutorial. So, like, if you're doing an animation and you want there to be a mouse pointer on the screen to move to the right spot without it just gliding, well, I'm going to tell you how to do that. So first you're going to create a new sprite, and then you got to draw it, um, you want to make it pretty small, and you want to make it look like a mouse pointer. I'm doing this on mobile right now, so it's kind of hard. Um, you can follow me on Scratch, uh, at 279-139, or 279-139-test. Oh dear. Yeah, I can't do this. Here's what, since it's hard for me on mobile, you don't have to do this. I'm just going to make a box. Go to this tool. Ugh. This is so hard. Okay. Here. No, oh, this is taking way too long. I think I'll just fast forward this part. Finally, I'm done. Um, okay, after you've made your mouse pointer, mine looks terrible. Now this trick on these is 25 blocks. So you want to go to variables, and you want to click make a list. And you're going to name this one mouse x. And you're going to make another one and name it Mouse Y. You can do for all the sprites if you want to, but I'd recommend doing it just for this sprite. And then it doesn't have to be cloud. Um, and you can name it pretty much whenever. You want to make a variable and call it next. It can be like something else. But I usually like to do next. Now again, next could be just for that sprite or any sprite. Um, you're going to want to do when key space pressed. Um, after that, you're going to do repeat until key... S pressed. So what this is doing when you press space, it will repeat what's ever inside there until you press S. Um so that's cool. And then you're gonna click well you're gonna get a Go to mouse pointer button, which is in the motion. You click go to random position and make it a go to mouse pointer. Put it in there. 
So when you press space until you press S, it's going to go to your mouse pointer. And then this one, you're going to do add, um, add thing to mouse X and add thing to mouse Y. Um, and then you're going to go back up to motion. And you're going to click. It's at the bottom. Why isn't this working? You're going to click the bring the X position over thing and mouse X and bring the Y position thing over thing and mouse Y. Um, and this means it adds wherever the mouse pointer is into the list. Then you're also going to do um, delete all of mouse X and delete all of mouse Y here. Then you're gonna do, I think you're gonna do set. Here, you might want to delete the my variable. You're gonna set next to zero at the top and change next by one right here. You're also going to need to add a weight block, which is weight point zero three, or you can do zero point zero three um, seconds. And what this is doing is when you press space, it deletes every, it's set next to zero and deletes everything in these two lists. Then until you press S, it's gonna go to the mouse pointer and log the X and Y position into these lists and change the next by one. Okay, and then you're going to do, you go to events and click a win I receive. Now you can do, you can do win flag click or a, um, a message it I'm gonna do when flag clicked so just when you click the flag it does it um and I'm gonna do a repeat actually no I want to leave the repeat. We're going to get rid of all these nexts. Now don't delete the variable. Just... Actually, you can even leave that next right there if you want. Nah. Bring the, bring the next right here. So it goes when flag clicked, set next to zero, repeat ten, change next by one. And you're going to do... repeat length of mouse X um, and do so it's so how long the list is which is 46,800 46,000 well, 47,000 now I guess um, gonna change next by one and I'm gonna do
bring a go to in. And if you want, you can change this 0 to a 1 if you'd like. Um, you're going to go to, go to variables, scroll down to the lists section, and go to bring in. I don't know why this is happening. Whenever I scroll up, it scrolls back down. Whenever I scroll down, it does not scroll up. You're going to bring an item 1 of mouse X into the X section and an item 1 of mouse Y into the Y, y section. You're going to go back to the top of variables. Bring this next over the ones. Okay, then don't forget, go to control, bring a weight 0 0.03 in there, okay, now that's pretty much how it works, but I'm going to change this so it works on mobile. Then we can test it. When this sprite clicked, repeat until 